Hi, this is Megan with Beataholic, and today I'm going to show you how to make these earrings, which are the Wild at Heart earring kit earrings. So here I have one completed, and I'm going to show you how to make a second one. You're going to need a pair of chain nose pliers, a pair of round nose pliers, and a flush cutter plier. You're also going to need two Swarovski Wild Heart beads, and then a Swarovski bicone bead, an earring hook, an eye pin, and a head pin. So you will get all of those pieces in your kit, and then you just need these little tools. So to start with, we're going to go ahead and hang our Wild Heart bead on our eye pin. Go ahead and insert it in, and you will see the top of the eye pin loop does actually go up into the bead hole a little bit. That's fine. We're just going to make a simple wire loop on top of the bead. So you're just going to grab the eye pin and use it to bend the wire about 45 degree angle, and then use the round nose pliers to grab right above that bend, and then bend the wire around. And you can rotate your pliers and grab with the other side so that you can complete that loop. And then use your cutters to trim off the excess. and then just straighten that out. Okay, and then we're going to do the same thing with our head pin and our bicone bead. The bicone bead is a, a crystal AB, so it has an AB finish on one half. Go ahead and put that AB finished half up so that you see a little, a little bit more. And we're going to create another simple wire loop above the bead. So again, you're going to grab it with your pliers, bend at a 45 degree angle, and then use your round nose, bring the wire around, rotate the pliers, and complete the loop, and then just trim off the excess. And now we're going to open the loop a little bit more and just put it through the bottom loop from your eye pin and then holding the bicone go ahead and twist that closed. So now we just need to hang our earring from the earring hook. Just use your chain nose pliers to gently twist open the earring hook and then go ahead and hang it by the top loop and twist it closed again. And then you'll need to just repeat the process with your other materials to create your second earring for the set. And that is how you create the Wild at Heart earrings. 